Hey guys, so today I am back with a highly requested video, but before I get into that too much, I just do want to sort of let you guys know something. When I started my new job a few months ago, I said that I was going down to one video a week because with this job it was just hard to manage that two and three videos a week that I had been doing. And that is still true. I am still very busy with this job and my schedule is different every week, so I never quite know what to expect. But I've also been having some health issues and I have been particularly unmotivated to make extra videos lately. It's just really hard when you have no energy and you feel very sick. Um, it's just hard to sit down and make a video and then edit it and then take the time to upload it. And it's just, it's all very difficult when you're having health troubles. If any of you guys have ever been through anything like this, then you know. Uh, but I am in the process, I have begun the process of getting a diagnosis and getting all of this looked into and figured out. So don't worry, I am okay. But it's just been very hard to maintain even the one video a week that I've been doing. I've been trying very hard. There are some weeks when I'm like two or three days later getting that video uploaded that I wanted to. And that's just how it goes. But I am doing my best. And I thank you guys so much for still supporting me and being here. Um, so I'm hoping that I will start feeling better soon and things will start getting better for me and my life. I've just, I've been like... Not really blowing off but I've just been like distant from friends and family and just like not committing to extra things just because of my health but like I said hopefully that is getting figured out and things will go back to at least better soon also yes we do have a not really a change of scenery but I sort of like rearranged my office so now we have the desk behind me and it is a little cluttered right now if you see like random things when I move I have a stack of wedding invitations that I'm still trying to get out and just a bunch of other stuff that has gotten piled up on the desk and this is my little bear from my mom for graduating with my masters in music because music had a pink hood so I just set him up there because I thought he was cute. So back on topic sort of uh, you guys may have noticed I've even been distant on social media you know on Instagram and especially Twitter lately even here on YouTube I've been kind of distant in the comments and stuff and that's just because it's just so hard to motivate myself to do anything it's not just motivation it's like just I have no energy to even go to my job so it's hard to do anything extra and a lot of times I just come home from work and sleep and I haven't done a lot of extra things to post about on Instagram like I used to try to do fun things and like take fun pictures and do all this cool stuff and I just I don't do anything cool anymore because I don't have any freaking energy to do anything so with all of that being said today I just wanted to do a fun video that you guys have requested. I wanted to do something for you just to let you know I'm still here, I still want to connect with you, and I'm still listening to what you want. So without any further ado, this is my updated 5 eighths of an inch plug collection. I am still at 5 eighths of an inch. Um, not a whole lot has changed since my last collection. I think I did a collection like a little over a year ago, and I have added some pieces to that. Um, several sets of plugs have been added to that. I will do my best to tell you all where each set of plugs is from. Um, I am thinking about stretching up to three-fourths of an inch and maybe all the way up to an inch at some point. Um, so we'll see, but for now I'm still at five-eighths of an inch. I will at least be there until after the wedding in October because I ordered my wedding plugs in five-eighths of an inch. So that is where I will be at least until after the wedding. So here is my collection. I still do keep some of my plugs in this little like piano box just because it's super cute and super handy. Um, this is where more of my plugs that I don't wear on a daily basis. This is where they get stored just because this looks cute sitting up on my shelf and it is a little hard to open. Not really hard, just like there are several steps to open this thing. Um, so most of my daily plugs actually are in this pouch. When we moved, I just like grabbed a pouch and shoved some stuff in it that was on a little shelf that we had above our bed. But that was like part of that house. So all the stuff on that shelf has been like it's had to find a new home and some things have not found a new home yet like my plugs that were all just laying out randomly on that shelf so I just put them in this pouch and this little pouch has been sitting on my dresser and this actually works great for my daily plugs because I can just reach in here and be like oh I want these so let's just start with this the first pair of plugs I am pulling out is from a online store called Love Kills Boutique. I actually found them on Instagram that's just their handle is Love Kills Boutique I believe it's lovekillsboutique.com um, it is basically, I believe, two sisters, maybe. Um, it's people making plugs 
um, and using the profits to support their dad who has cancer. I believe that's the story. Basically, when you buy plugs from them, your money is going to fight cancer. So I think that's super cool. But I saw these and I absolutely had to have these. These are bees. How cute are these? And I love dangly plugs. I don't have a lot just because they're not practical. But I love having a pair just, you know, in case you want a, a really nice set of earrings one day. You just have some nice plugs. So these are like yellow kind of glitter in the middle with like silver little silver balls around sorry I can't talk today um, and then the dangles are just like honeycombs and bees I love these so so much the next pair is probably my next go-to pair and these are a pair of opal light teardrop plugs how beautiful are these I love these so much they're a little scratched and fingerprinty because I wear these a lot um, but yeah here they are these are from Body Art Forms. I actually bought them from their Etsy page, but I assume you could buy them just from bodyartforms.com. So there's these. Next, I have these from Plugs by Emma. These are what she calls gauges, which I think are hilarious. Um, basically, you know, just like a gauge that would be and a car dashboard. So these were punny and adorable. And I love these a lot. Next, also by Plugs from Emma, is just a pair of pink glitter plugs. These are super pretty. Next from Hot Topic is a pair of Cats in Space. If you know me, you know I had to have these as soon as I saw them. Next is a pair either from Hot Topic or Spencer's. I'm not really sure which one. Um, these, I had to have them because they match my wedding ring. I can't even hold these. They're just like black and white diamonds, like alternating I guess you might say and there's hair all in these and I'm sorry that's so gross oh. but yeah I had to have these because they match my wedding ring next is another pair from Hot Topic and these actually had dangling skulls on them and I took them off and they're down here in this bag somewhere and I have never put them on because I wore these for like a recital and these are kind of like my nice really dressy plugs and I didn't want like dangly skulls hanging off of them but I might put them back on someday because they're kind of cute but these are just like black roses um, with like silver kind of like filigree type looking stuff around them these are kind of big but they're not heavy at all um they're like a plastic or acrylic plug i guess you might say so i never wear these very long at all for a lot of reasons but i still think they're pretty next is another pair from love kills boutique these are just roses and these are kind of like a corally reddish pinkish i don't know they're not like true red but they're a really pretty color i love these a lot Next is another pair from, I believe, Spencer's, and these are just lions. They have this really cool, like, pattern around them, and they're gold, and they're really pretty. They're a little heavy, but these are another pair of, like, kind of dressy plugs that I wear. Or these to work a lot, because they kind of just look like big button earrings, you know? Next, this used to be a pair, but now it's just one plug because I lost the other one, and I swore I would have found it when we moved, but I never did. Um, Pretty sure James knocked it off the coffee table, and I don't know whatever happened to it. But I love these, and I'm so sad. It, when I do stretch up, I'm going to buy another pair of these in the next size because I love them so much. But anyway, this is just a white glitter plug from Plugs by Emma. I'm so sad I lost the other one to this. But like I said, when I do change sizes, I'm definitely getting a new pair of these because these are so pretty. Next is another pair from Plugs by Emma, and these are a little dirty and scratched and worn just because I do wear them a lot. Uh, but these are just a pair of black glitter. They do kind of look like navy or almost kind of purpley in this light. But they are black glitter plugs uh, from Plugs by Emma, like I said. And yeah, I'm definitely ordering another pair of these when I stretch up as well because these are so worn because I obviously wear them a lot. Next is another pair from Love Kills Boutique. These are just a pair of like plain black plugs with um, red like jewels or gems on them. These are really pretty. I wear these a lot too. Next in here, I believe these are from Hot Topic or Spencer's. I just have a pair of red silicone plugs. Um, I wore these on 4th of July and like that whole weekend because I was wearing red, white, and blue the whole weekend because that's me as a person. Um, so these just ended up in my daily bag. I haven't worn them since and I hadn't worn them for like a year until then, but yeah. Next is a pair of moon plugs, I believe from Spencer's. Um, these are really, really pretty. I like these a lot. They're just little crescent moons. I don't wear these a whole lot anymore, but I used to wear them a lot. And I used to actually turn these around backwards because they have like the screw off backs um, and they're just solid black. So I used to wear those backwards a lot when I just wanted like a solid black plug. Next in my little daily bag here, I don't wear these a whole lot, but these are just plain silver tunnels or eyelets. I believe these are from Amazon. 
I think they're stainless steel. I hope they are. <laughs> I don't wear these a whole lot at all. And then the last pair I have in my little pouch here is just a pair of clear silicone plugs. I used to wear these a whole lot um, because I really like them. And I, stu I still do really like them. I, stu I still do really like them. I just don't wear them a whole lot. But yeah, they're just clear um, tunnels or eyelets. They are silicone, super comfortable to sleep in. Um, so yeah, these are from Spencer's. And then the pair I have in before I move on to my little box is just a pair of black silicone eyelets, sort of like those others I showed you. These are from, again, either Spencer's or Hot Topic. And these are just what I had in today because I didn't have to work or anything, so I was just wearing these because they're comfortable. Sorry, I had to stop and plug my camera in, so we've changed views a little bit because I had to move a little so the cord could like reach to where I have my camera set up. I just cannot get it together today. But uh, I'm gonna move on now to my little box of plugs that I have. Okay, so this is why I don't use this box for my everyday plugs is because there are like three steps to get into this thing, but it's super cute and I love it. So it works to like sit on my shelf, but not for like every, everyday use. But uh, yeah, I'll just show you the few pairs of plugs that I have in here. The first pair that I'm pulling out here is just this pair of like, I don't know, sort of like tie-dye marbly silicone eyelets. These are from Spencer's as well. They actually came in the same pack as that uh, clear silicone pair. And these just have like black and white and teal in them. Super, super pretty. I love these. I don't wear these a whole lot just because I don't have a lot that goes with them, but I still really love them. Next is a pair of pink silicone eyelets. I don't know if I mentioned where the red ones are from, but they're from wherever, they're from the same place wherever these are from. I believe I ordered them from Amazon. Uh, both of these pairs. I believe they were like one, one of those like buy one get one free things or something like that. So just a pair of pink silicone plugs. I hardly ever wear these but hey I have them so. Next is a pair of black silicone plugs not eyelets or tunnels just like solid plugs but they are silicone if you can kind of tell they're squishy. I used to wear these a whole lot when my ears were like new to the size of five eighths of an inch because it was sometimes hard to get like double flared plugs that were like you know steel or wood or whatever it was kind of hard to get those into my ear like to get the uh um lip or whatever like the the flare that's what it's called obviously flare um it was hard to get that like through my ear so these would squish down a little and i could kind of fit the flare into my ear easier i don't wear these at all anymore just because i don't really wear solid black plugs anymore um nothing against them i just never reach for solid black but yeah, I like these a lot. I got these from a store called, I believe it's Razzle Dazzle. I believe that's what it's called. No, that doesn't seem right. I don't remember what it's called. Razzmatazz. That's what the name of the store is. Razzmatazz. It is on Bardstown Road in Louisville. Um, so that's where I picked these up. I used to be really obsessed with wood plugs. I don't wear them so much anymore. I do some in the winter, but I really definitely don't wear them at all in the summer. Uh, but I did get a few pairs of wood plugs from Amazon.com and this is one of the pairs I got, just kind of like a tannish color I guess you might say. And then I got this dark brown pair. These are super pretty. And then I got this black wood pair and these were easily the ones I wore the most. Um, again, I don't wear these that much anymore, especially since it's summer. I really like wood for the winter just because it keeps your ears a little warmer. You know, metal in the winter is horrible. Even at a smaller size, it's still just, it's no fun. Um, so these are mainly what I wear in the winter, but um, I mean, I still really like them, so. And then I have a pair of gold eyelets, also from Amazon. These are really pretty. I don't wear gold a whole lot, but I did get them for when I used to wear like gold uh, facial jewelry and stuff like that. If I was just wearing, you know, a lot of brown or something, I'd like to wear gold. So that's what I got these for. And then I have a rose gold pair, which honestly I probably wore more than the yellow gold. Um, I really like these. There's not a whole lot of difference, but I think these are just a little more subtle and I really like, I really love rose gold, honestly. I have that same pair of plugs, but in like a multicolor, kind of like a rainbowy type of design, I guess you might say. I don't know. Then I have the same pair of stainless steel eyelets, but in blue. These are super pretty. I hardly ever wear these, but they're pretty. And then the last pair I have to show you is a pair of black stainless steel eyelets. Eyelets? What did I just say? Eyelets? Eyelets. <laughs> tunnels. A lot of people call them tunnels, but the proper name is eyelets. Um, so yeah, there these are. 
And then I do have my wedding plugs. They are not in my like daily collection. I have them put away in my wedding stuff. I actually have a little bag over here. I'm not going to show them in this video just simply because they are for my wedding. I have shown them in a video in the past. I think I did a plugs by Emma review and they are in that video, but I'm just not going to show them in this video because it's just a few weeks away from my wedding and I know it's just like a pair of plugs in my ears, but I just have all my wedding stuff put away and I don't want to like show a lot of things even though I like post my flowers on Instagram, whatever, whatever. I just don't want to show them in this video because they're not like a pair of daily plugs. I'm going to wear them once probably, you know, so anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm sorry I'm so scattered. That is... That has to do with my health, I will tell you that. Just this like lack of focus and concentration. Trust me, it's way worse for me on a daily basis than it is in videos for you guys, but I'm sure it's frustrating. But yeah, um, that's just me at this point. So I hope you guys enjoyed this and I will see you guys in my next video. I hope you're doing wonderful as always and I love you guys so much. Bye.